Hey YouTube, today we've got a, another Bulgarian magazine, but this time it is a Bulgarian steel magazine. It's a 762 by 39 millimeter. So let's get right into it. Got a five rib standard magazine. So on this guy, I, I've seen these with four welds and I've seen them with two. So this one's only a two weld, so you only have one on this side. Then you've got one on this side, but oddly enough, they welded the front on these, which is unusual. I don't really know if any other countries have uh, done that. I uh, I just found that odd. Um, you've got very light, light in like profile, but I mean, they're reasonably deep. They're deeper than Hungarian mag uh, welds for sure. Um, you have pretty much the same welds on the back. So how you identify these as Bulgarian magazines is that on the spine, there may be a marking that's a that's two concentric circles with a 10 inside of it or two concentric circles with an E inside of it. Um, I've heard on some of these magazines that are stamped pretty light, so uh, you got to use your eyes very well. Um, we've got standard two ball follower, or uh, excuse me, floor plate. Then we have a, this magazine appears to be actually polymer, uh, uh, disassembly latch, rounded, no indentation, like some of the uh, 545 magazines do. Um, you got a standard spine that runs all the way up to the, uh, the locking catch. And how you identify these magazines as Bulgarian, if there aren't any stamp marks, actually this magazine is devoid of stamp marks, so there are none, is if you look right up here, let me get a pointing instrument, this top rib right here. So either uh, other countries' magazines will, this rib will run all the way up to the top right here, or it'll cut off at a 90 right around here, kind of like the Polish 74 mags actually. Um, the Bulgarian magazine comes off at a 45 degree angle, or it's kind of like a curved, or curves actually, it's actually a, not a straight line like this one is. Either one of those would make it a Bulgarian would uh, give it away as a Bulgarian magazine. So that's about it, guys. Uh, I, I don't know if I mentioned it. It's got a 30-round witness window on it. But other than that, it just looks like a typical steel magazine. So that's really the big giveaway. I'll look for that more than I would actually look for markings. So if you enjoyed this video, please rate, comment, subscribe. More heading at you soon. See ya.